guys, today I'm doing my what I got for Christmas video. I'm super excited to share this stuff with you. I have quite a bit of stuff, but it's all relatively inexpensive, mainly because in my family I only get gifts from like four or five people. We don't have a super big family, so we kind of buy each other just a lot of smaller, less expensive things. But the most important thing that I got for Christmas that I'm so excited to share with you guys because it's not really just a gift for me, it is also a gift for you guys too. Um, I got studio lights. If you can't tell from the fact that it is way brighter in my videos than it usually is, yeah, I got studio lights. Um, it's like 5 o'clock at night right now. It is super dark outside. There's not a single ray of sun coming into this room right now. But, yeah, studio lights. So the brand that I got my lights from is Limo Studio. And I really don't know too much about it. I didn't do a ton of research before I bought them. I just kind of bought the most popular photography lighting that they had on Amazon.com. It was $55 for a set of two umbrella lights and one like basic light that I have going on behind me. Um, but yeah, it's really exciting and it's really awesome. They're really good quality. I guess I don't know too much about video lighting and I will learn more as I go along in this process, but I'm really excited about it. They're really awesome. So that is like the most important gift that I got for Christmas. I also got to go along with that a new tripod. This is the Targus 58 inch tripod. Um, we just found it at Walmart and it is way better than the tripods that I had before. I've actually gone through two of these smaller Targus tripods and they have both broken. This one doesn't even have a top piece for it anymore. This one, the top piece of it broke. So I would recommend just buying the bigger, more expensive one if you're going to go with the like low-end um, Targus brand tripods. I would definitely say go for the more expensive ones, the bigger ones, because the one that I have right now is much better quality than these. I've gone through so many of these. Seriously, they're not good. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to all the other things that I got for Christmas, just the smaller, less expensive stuff. So first off, my mom bought me a bunch of clothes, which was really weird because she doesn't generally buy me clothes for Christmas, just because she's not very good at picking out clothes because she knows that I have kind of a really weird style and that most of the time I'm not going to like what she buys me, but she actually did a really good job this year. I'm super proud of her. So first she got me a sweater from Forever 21, and it's just a really cute open knit sweater that I really like. It's white and you guys know I love white and cream colored sweaters in the winter and yeah it's just super cute. I really love the open knit style of it. It's long so it can be worn with leggings and she also bought me leggings to go with it. So she got me two pairs of printed leggings and they're both adorable. I'm so proud of you mom. Good job. So she got me these ones that have this, I don't even like know how to explain what this print is that's on them but they're just like an abstract, kind of like floral, black and white print. It's really, really pretty, and it looks really good with the sweater she bought me. And yeah, these are also from Forever 21. And then she got me another pair that's like tribal print, and these ones are navy and white, and they just have this really cool tribal print design on them, also from Forever 21. So that's awesome. Then she got me a couple of things from American Eagle. So she got me another pair of leggings. She knows I love leggings. I'm obsessed with leggings in the winter time especially. So she got me um, this pair of gray tribal patterned leggings. And they're actually like textured, which is really cool. Um, they're really sturdy material. They're really stiff and they like hold in all of my flab, which is nice because I have flab. But, and then she bought me a cardigan to go with those. So this is also from American Eagle and I have worn this cardigan so many times and Christmas was like four days ago. I think I've worn it every day since Christmas. I'm obsessed with it. It's a long cardigan so I can wear it with my leggings and it covers my booty and then it's just this really pretty color and it's kind of like a salt and pepper color and I absolutely love it and you guys will probably see like a bunch of Instagram pictures of me wearing this because I'm my obsessed. My mom also bought me some slippers because she buys me slippers every year. These ones are from Forever 21. They just have these adorable heart prints on them and they're like ballet flat slippers and I love them they're so cute and comfy and then she also got me some pajamas from Forever 21 um, I'm really into night shirts lately no idea why I just don't like to wear pants to bed so she got me this cute night shirt from Forever 21 it's just got snowflakes on it and it's super adorable and then every year my family buys each other Lush goodies, so I got a couple of Lush bath bombs from my mom. So the first one is the, oh my god, the first one is falling apart. <laughs> the first one is the uh, luxury Lush pod, which is supposed to smell like 
pudding or something, I guess. But what's really awesome about it is that all of these adorable little balls, little polka dots on it, they actually fizz out that color into your bathtub, so your bathtub turns into this really cool rainbow. I'm really excited to use this. I think I'm going to use it tonight. I just saved it so I could show it to you guys for this video, but yeah. Totally going to use this tonight. It smells really good and really sweet. And then the other one she got me I've actually used before and I'm totally obsessed with it. It is the Shoot for the Stars bath bomb. And this actually turns your water black and sparkly. So it looks like you're swimming in outer space. It's really cool and it smells like snow fairy, so that's awesome. Oh, got some in my nose. A couple more stocking stuffers. I got socks, because I get socks in my stocking every single year. And then I also got a Shea Sugar Scrub from the brand Tree Hut, and it's in the scent Coconut Lime. And seriously, I don't really hear people on YouTube talk a lot about this brand, but it's, it's an amazing brand. You can find them at Ulta or like Target, and they just make magnificent bath products. I have an almond body butter from them as well that is just amazing. So I'm really excited to try out this uh, body scrub. I got some chapstick in my stocking. Another one of those things that I get every year, and an EOS balm, and deodorant. Every year my mother puts deodorant in my stocking as if to insinuate that I smell. Seriously? Hansel. I think my mom was running out of ideas for the stockings this year because she put some weird stuff in there, but yeah, um, vanilla cookie hand soap. And then my grandma bought everybody some Ghirardelli Prudinium Peppermint Hot Cocoa. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm really excited because I bet it's absolutely delicious because it's from Ghirardelli. And then I got some razors, because who doesn't need razors? And my mommy bought this adorable necklace for me. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but it looks like a bolo tie. It's super cool. It doesn't... Like, it doesn't have a claspy thingy. I don't know what that is. Claspy thingy. It just kind of looks like a bolo tie, and these little ends just kind of hang off. And it's super cute. I really like it. Um, it's totally hipster, and it's totally me. So I love it. I also have a buttload of candy. So if anybody needs candy, you give me a call because I really shouldn't be eating all of this. It's super unhealthy. Grandma got me these adorable gloves. They're fingerless gloves, and they say love you on the fingers. And they're actually from the brand Juicy Couture which was surprising that my grandmother bought me something from Juicy Couture, but thanks, Grandma. And she got me this scarf to go along with those gloves, and it has these adorable pom-poms on it, and they're huge and awesome, and I love it. I actually find myself playing with it more often than I find myself wearing it, but nonetheless, it is very entertaining, and I really like it. And then TJ actually got me a couple of candles from Bath & Body Works. I knew I was getting these because he's real smart and he forgot to wrap them and he left the bag sitting open on the table when I got home from work, so I knew I was getting these candles. But he got me the uh, Cinnamon Caramel Swirl candle, which I've never tried before and I was super surprised that he picked out such a good candle because this smells fan-freaking-tastic. <sighs> It's like I live in a coffee shop, which is the dream. Like, it's literally the dream. And then he also got me black tie. He got me two black tie candles. I actually stole one out of the bag before Christmas and burned it because I was super excited. I love black tie. Um, I had the, one of the small ones this year, but I haven't actually gotten a three-wick black tie candle this year until now. So the other one is burning right there. And then, from TJ's family, I asked them for this because I really, really needed this. We got a set of Faberware pots and pans, which is awesome because our pots and pans are literally falling apart. Like the handles have come off of them and we've had to screw them back on because that's how like crappy and old our pots and pans are. Granted, they bought us the first set of pots and pans too. This one is much nicer and I'm really excited about it. So yeah, pots and pans. I know that's not exciting to you guys, but I'm really excited about this. And I know I've said this about every gift that I've gotten, but this is possibly the most exciting thing that I got for Christmas this year. I was so surprised by it. Literally, I generally know what all of my presents are before I get them because I ask for them or I pick them out and physically wrap them myself. But this one, I had no idea I was getting. It's the T-Swift album. So it's a two-disc vinyl. It comes with all 13 songs that are on the album and I'm obsessed with it. And on the inside, it has all of the lyrics to the songs. So yeah, it's super exciting. I've been playing it constantly. TJ bought it for me and he's actually kind of sad that he bought it for me now because he doesn't really like Taylor Swift because he's a boy and he's been listening to it nonstop. So, sorry. 
So yeah, that's everything that I got for Christmas. I'm sorry if this video came out very long. Honestly, I'm not trying to brag. Most of the stuff was very inexpensive and just kind of like stocking stuff for stuff just because the actual presents that I got were kind of expensive and really awesome. So thank you to everyone who bought me awesome stuff this year. I am really excited about everything. I love all of my presents. But I'm sweating my butt off under these uh, studio lights, so I'm going to stop recording now and end this video. Please make sure that you guys comment and subscribe and check out all my links that are going to be in the bottom bar and I will see you guys next time. I love you guys. Bye. Blah, blah, blah. Blah. Ha. Ah. So hot in here.